Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Rosanna. So in this week's video, I'm going to take you along and share with you all the makeup that I'm packing for my trip. I'm sure you guys know I'm leaving for Italy soon. So that is what we're going to be talking about today. But before we get into that video, I would love, love, love for you to subscribe to my channel. You could ring the bell. It would give you notifications of when I post, which is every Tuesday and every Saturday. So yep, like, make comments, tell your friends, subscribe, help a newbie out. I would so, so appreciate your support. And thank you so, so much for helping me grow this channel. And now without further ado, let's get started. All right. So every time I travel, I take my alley glines with me. These are the original bags that she came out with. She's got tons of colors now, but this was like the whole kit and caboodle, which I added on to it. So I am going to bring um, her brush. This is her brush bag. What? Um, P.S. I'm just sitting here makeshift mayhem all over the place. Um, it is Tuesday, by the way, as I'm filming. I'm leaving on Thursday. Say no more. I love this bag. I love that it's got like a dual elastic. Okay, it's dirty. So what? Who cares? It's okay. Love, love, love this. I'm bringing my BK Beauty brushes and my Refer brushes. By the way, Refer just came out with three new prototypes. Their brushes are natural hair and they're just coming out with three prototypes of um, synthetic brushes. I have them right over here. I haven't tried them yet, um, but I'm definitely, definitely going to bring them and try them out. I love, love, love Refer. I think they're so great. I I have nothing but respect for them. They genuinely, genuinely ask for customer feedback and they listen. That's what's so fantastic. But anyway, I'm definitely going to bring my BK Beauty and my Refer brushes. I'm going to toss this over here. Um, like I said, I do have like the full one. I do have this full one. It's got two larges. I have like some smalls, partridge, pear tree. I also put like eyeshadow palettes in here. There's some back here that you can put them in. Anyway, love, love, love this. I'm scared. I'm scared. I am um, just put this over there. Um, I know I'm bringing too much, so I may just cut back from what I'm showing you now. Um, we'll see. I don't know. And then I want to come back later on when I get back and I show you a video of girl. How much of that makeup did you really use? Why are you lying, girl? Let's let's jump right in. You know I'm bringing this makeup by Mario um, Foundation. I love it. This is the makeup by Mario Foundation Surreal Skin. I had this in 8N. Um, I have been using a lighter hand lately. I'd say like the past like six, eight months-ish. To me, this foundation to me is a full coverage. I think it's so, so beautiful. So this is a definite. And then, uh, let's see here. Girl, look at look how, look. I had the nerve. You know I have backups of everything. Mm -mm. This is the L'Oreal True Match Nude Hyaluronic Tinted Serum. But this one is in 2-3. Girl, we're in March. I'm still wet as a ghost. I did go back and I do have um, a 3-4 and a 4-5. I have no idea where you're going with that 4-5. Maybe like in the depths of summer. We'll get to it. But anyway, this is all I have left. But I'm bringing it. I don't care. This is my absolute favorite. This, like this type of coverage is what I've been loving lately. But I did grab... Um, the NARS Pure Radiant Tint Moisturizer. I'm definitely going to bring this. This is in um, uh, Mykonos Medium Zero. Like I said, I've been liking that um, tint, if you will. Like not, not even like medium coverage. Just a little bit less than medium. So that's why I've been have been loving these right over here. But girl, I gotta bring Mario. I gotta bring. I gotta bring you, my man. Um, let's just get down to the nitty gritty of my palettes. You know I'm bringing this. You know it. This is the new Natasha Denona Hyper Natural Face Palette. Honestly, girl, this is all you need. You don't need much, but you know, you'll see. So I'm definitely going to bring that. You know I'm bringing my man. You know I'm bringing my man. This is the Patrick Ta. This is the Major Dimension. This is his original one because this, mm -mm, that, this is my favorite, favorite palette of his. Although I, I do love his all matte palette, but something special about this little lover. So this is a definite. And then I'm also bringing the Natasha Denona um, uh, Glam Palette. So nice. What are we, in a horror movie? What, what the hell? I don't know why that squeaks, but this is gorgeous. This is an absolute must. I don't know where you think you're going, but whatever. Um, so I'm going to definitely bring that. I wanted to bring the I Need, um, her I Need a Nude Palette, but I friggin' dropped it. It shattered all over the place. I was heartbroken. I did manage to put them in. Some of the colors, like especially the shimmers, are very loose. Oh, hell no. I can't even. Because mm -mm, if something happens to that palette, absolutely not. Um, yeah. And then, like, don't kill me. Like, like last time we were talking when I said, like, every time I pack, sometimes I pack, like, um, products that are no longer available. 
and I can't talk about it, but I'm going to tell you, honestly, I'm going to bring the KKW Beauty Palette. This is called Mrs. West. But anyway, I love it. Number one, it's so compact and it's perfect and delicious and beautiful. But it's these colors. They're so friggin' simple. I, I, hate, I hate it that they're no longer available. So nice. I'm going to bring it. Okay, there. I said it. I don't care. You're going to laugh about this. You're going to laugh. But why, though? You don't even wear primer. Why? You don't even wear primer. This is the e.l.f. Poreless Putty Primer. Girl, where are you going with that? Mm-hmm. It's delicious. It smells like nothing. Yeah, I'm going to bring it. Why, though? But why? Maybe I'll use it. No, you're not. But I'm going to bring it anyway. And then I have even more of a nerve. I have even more of a nerve. I'm also bringing the Rare Beauty Primer. Yeah. Why? Just answer the question. Answer the question. Why? I don't even wear primer, but I'm going to bring it. I'm going to bring it. Highlighters, girl. You know how I feel about the, uh, the, the Juvia's Place highlighter. This is the Tribe Highlighter in Volume 3. It is, I mean, it is gore gorgeous. Definitely bring in that. Um, you know I'm bringing this. This is the Rare Beauty in Enlightened. Definitely bring in that. And see, so why couldn't they all be like this? An eyeshadow, a blush, blah, blah, blah. This is the Natasha Denona My Mini Dream Glow Blush. It is so freaking pretty. So, I mean, gorgeous. And I have to tell you the truth, I did not expect to like this highlighter. It is so, so pretty. So, um, and I'm, as I'm looking, I'm going in three, threes, and threes. I don't like it. You know what happens in threes. Mm -mm, get it out of the universe. No, thank you, Jesus. Absolutely not. But I am looking like at three, threes, and threes. But why? Mm -mm. No, here's a four. I am bringing the Fenty Beauty. This is the um, How Many Carrots Diamond Bomb. Now, I had this the whole time. Look at Cutie Patootie. I love, love, love this. To me, this is the ultimate topper to me. I didn't know I had this one. So I got the gargantuous one. Where am I going to go with that? I'll have that for the next 30 years. So I'm definitely, definitely going to bring this. I think it's so freaking pretty. So we're definitely going to bring that. Um, blushes. My man, he's coming with. This is uh, the uh, Patrick Todd Double Take Cream and Powder Blush. This one is in She's Blushing. These are not the newer ones that he just came out with. Although I did pick up two of them, but I picked up like the brightest coral and the brightest pink. I just, and I didn't pick up like the neutral one. She's enough, I think. But I think this is appropriate because, girl, I don't know what we're doing. What are we doing? Where are we going? How am I going to just, don't even talk about the clothes. Don't even, don't, don't even talk about it because you're going to be in jeans and sweatpants, but you bought 5,000. Mm -mm. Anyway, I thought this would be the most appropriate. It goes with everything. So I, I, I'm definitely going to bring this. You know how I feel about my Jane Ardell. So this is the Pure Pressed Blush in Barely Rose. I think it's so friggin' pretty. Look at that. So, so nice. So, so nice. So I'm bringing that. I could have sworn I had another blush. Oh, yes. Mm-hmm. Yeah, just why are they all in threes? I don't like it. I'm going to have to either take one out and put one in. This is the Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk Matte Beauty Blush Wand. Now, you know I'm not a matte girl. To me, this looks very glowy, very glowy on me. It is so beautiful. I don't know if it, I don't know if it's the formula or the color, but this is so, so pretty. So this is a definite. So we did that. And um, let's see. Bronzers. Again, my man. There you go. This is, um, this is his cream and powder bronzer and she sculpted i mean come on it's beautiful i have a cream i have a powder i love 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 this formula i love this color it is so so pretty and on top of that i'm also going to bring the l'oreal infallible um 24 hour bronzer why i don't know because i have a powder right there i need some versatility okay a girl needs to change her mind once in a while <gasps> And then, of course, mm -hmm, I have to bring this. This is the Rare Beauty. These are her sticks. These are her um, bronzer stick. I got this in Bright Side. But I also have another one that is more of a contoury color. I may just switch it up because I already have I already have them. Why? Girl, honestly, all you need is one because you got the cream and the powder right here. But no, you got to go. You, no, you have to do all that. Absolutely not. So I did that. I did that. Um, you know what? I don't have concealer here, but you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to bring the Natasha Denona um, High Glam Concealer. I'm going to do my N1, my N3, and I'm going to tell you the truth. Um, I have nerve, but I'm going to tell you the truth. 
I'm going to tell you the truth. A couple of videos ago, and I don't remember what it was for, I grabbed my Charlotte Tilbury Beautiful Skin Concealer. Girl, <laughs> it legit smells rancid. I never threw it away, girl, and I even used it. I even had the nerve to use it on, uh, on camera, but it is so nice. P.S. As I'm thinking about it, I'm going to put that on my list because the Sephora VIB sale is coming out in April, maybe the second week of April. I'll leave it down below, but I'm definitely going to put that on my list because I had forgotten how beautiful and creamy and silky and delicious that is. But um, I'm going to bring it and it smells. Yeah, I'm going to bring it anyway. <laughs> that I am. I'm going to do it. Uh, let me get here. Mascaras. I grabbed this Cutie Patootie, the Tower 28 mascara in a mini. So obviously you see it, it's not open. I'm definitely going to bring that. I'm definitely going to bring this because you know how much I love it. I cannot get underneath the eyes without a thin, um, without thin bristles. Mm -mm. So this is the L'Oreal um, Telescopic Carbon Black, which you know I love. I always talk about it. So I'm going to bring that. I'm also bringing the City Beauty Beyond Mascara. So friggin' good. So good definitely bringing that I, i'm also going to bring some tools because i'm thinking i may just do a video with my aunt she's my mom's um younger sister my mom was the oldest of four and they're 11 years apart so let's see if my mother was going to be uh 87 so 87 uh, 87, 77. So she's going to be 76 years old. Actually, her that's why we're going to Italy because her birthday and my dad's birthday, they're on the same day. And their birthday is on Sunday, so we're all going to celebrate. I recently just lost my mom, so I figured um, what a great way to celebrate my mom and my dad and my aunt. So we'll all be together, and I know my mom is going to be there in spirit. I cannot wait to get there and just share all these memories with her. But anyway, um, I'm going to bring some tools because I'm thinking I may do a makeup tutorial with my aunt to do makeup on her. I'm thinking. I don't want to use like my mascara. <laughs> no. So I'm going to bring some tools with me um, for powder. Now, that's legitimate. Girl, you don't even use powder. So I'm only going to bring one. I lied. I may just use a loose one. You know what? I think I'm going to bring the Givenchy because that's one of my newer um, powders and I know my daughter likes to use it too. But um, So this is the Charlotte Tilbury. I just This is a brand spanking new one. This is in one fair. I don't like to distort the color on my face with a powder so I always use like the lightest translucent porcelain or whatever because um, I don't want to mess up what I just did. But I think I am going to do the, um, I think I'm going to do the Givenchy as well. Lip liners, I'm going to, I'm going to just grab um, these nudes, I know it's a shocker. So this is the uh, Charlotte Tilbury Lip Cheat. And this one is in medium Pillow Talk Medium 2, which it's a little bit deeper than the Medium 1. I don't have it with me, but I'm definitely going to be using the Iconic Nude as well. I got um, the e.l.f. Cream Glide Lip Liners. I got this one in... Um, baddest beige and then this one is a uh, skin by kim's that i just reviewed recently i really really like them this one is in 04 they all look alike and then this one that i grabbed but i think i may put one of them back this is the elf uh phil phil frontal i think this was the collaboration with jennifer coolidge but that you can't get anymore dang it but um i'm gonna have to pull up i mean they're all friggin nudes these are all nudes girl why <gasps> One, two, three. Stop it. Now you're making me nervous. Uh-uh. So I'm going to have to pull one back and maybe bring in like another pink. I'm not sure. For eyeliners, that's it. The double whammy. You know how much I love these. This is the Too Faced Killer um, Eyeliner in Killer Espresso. And then this one is the Essence Stay and Play uh, Waterproof Gel Liner in Buffers Espresso. Listen, if you've ever been to Italy, I don't know about other countries, but you drink espresso 50 million times a day. We get up and we have it. And then mid-morning we have it again. And then like mid-afternoon we're going to go shopping because everybody comes home for lunch. And then we have to make lunch. And then we're going to have it after after lunch. And their lunch is like midday is their dinner. It's like a full-ass meal. So we're going to have it then. And then we're going to clean up. We're going to hang out. Maybe we'll rest for a little bit. And then we're going to say, you want to go to the bar? Their bar is not like our bar. Theirs is like a coffee bar, an ice cream bar. And we're going to go again. And then we may do like a little shopping. And then on the way home, because we have to make dinner, um, do you want to stop at the bar for, okay, we're going to do that. And then you have five, th so you're drinking five, six, seven, 12 cups of espresso uh, every day. My two eyeliners, Kill Espresso and But First Espresso, absolutely. And then for my lip smackings, 
Definitely the makeup by Mario. These are his new uh, lip smack and sticks, and these are his super satin lipsticks in Midtown. I'm definitely going to bring Midtown. I think it's so, so beautiful. I think it would look so perfect with the uh, Charlotte Tilbury, the pillow talk, because this one's, and especially the medium, this one's a little bit deeper. What do I have on my lips today? It could be. It could be this. I'm not really sure. And um, this is a little bit deeper, and I like that um, a little bit. A little bit of a contrast i don't like a full blown but this is so so nice um together i'm also bringing the natasha denona my dream lip smacking in natasha i think it's so so beautiful i'm going to bring one of those and i'm definitely going to bring her the lip gloss that goes with it so so nice and then um last but not least is the bk beauty luxe lipstick this one is an acceptance i loved as a matter of fact i was watching them before so um let's see let me see here. So this one in the middle, this is an acceptance right over here. And then this is the Natasha Denona, my dream. And then this one over here is the uh, Makeup by Mario. They're all just so, so beautiful. What the hell was that one? I don't remember, but anyway, I've been swatching. So I'm definitely going to bring that. So anyway, so I think that's it. I have to pull back. Girl, stop lying to the people. You're going to be in sweatpants the whole time. I hope not. No, don't do it, girl. Don't do it. But anyway, so that is it. I'm going to just try and put some um, shots in here, packing all this stuff up in my Allie Glines bag. And uh, yeah, so that is it. This is my video on just my makeup that I'm packing. I haven't even done my skincare. Mm -mm. But anyway, so that is it. This is my video. Thank you so, so much for sharing your time with me. And as always, you guys be good to each other, love each other, and have a great, great day. Bye. Maybe this is an omen. I still have my primers out. Mm-hmm. And somewhere I'm going to have to... And I still have to pack my foundation. So I'm going to have to reassess this, pull some stuff out, because I really, really just want to use one bag for each product. Like this is going to be my um, makeup. My other bag is going to be for my skincare. I'm going to try and keep it um, smaller than I have here. Anyway, so that's it, guys.